Hi guys, if you're new here, subscribe down below and hit that post notification bell so you can get notified every time I upload. By the title, you already know this is going to be a Starbucks video again um, because you guys love these. And somebody told me to record some of the tasks that we do at night. So today I'm going to be closing and I'm gonna record some of the tasks that we do at night. It depends on each store. Honestly, because some stores like to maybe do some prep at night and then some other ones like to do it in the morning or other ones uh, require to do it like at a different day part. But I'm going to do some of the things that somebody asked me to show how to clean the, the mistrenas. I'm not sure if you wanted to if you wanted to see like clean play stuff because during clean play things are uh, uh, things are washed or clean different. So, but I'm gonna do it as a I'm doing this as like in a regular day. Except the pumps, the pumps I am gonna have to put a, uh, just take them apart. I think I'm gonna be CS, I don't even know what I'm gonna be today, but I think I am gonna be CS, which is the person that cleans everything and um, just ends up uh, making sure that the store is clean and everything is uh, ready to go for the next day. I'll see you guys when I get there. So here I was working on some prep I was getting ready to mix the frap roast, which is water, and then those packets that I'm cutting. I'm doing some prep for Alexis tomorrow. So you're welcome, Alexis. Then here I was mixing the sweet cream, which is the one that we use well, for sweet cream. <laughs> And then we use it to make the vanilla streak and cold, cold foam. Then I was mixing the frap roast. <laughs> and then I was putting the lids and then just making sure I was dating them. So these are my dishes. That's what I'm gonna clean. Then I was washing them. After you wash them, you have to rinse them to put them in the sanitizer because you have to make sure that there's no soap in the sanitizer. And of course, I was scrubbing them to me it's easier to let them soak and then just scrub them because it's faster and then once you sanitize them you can put them in the dishwasher to sanitize or you can just do it manually in the last sink You're pregnant. Okay. So here I was taking apart the pump. There's a small blue band that goes inside the pump and you have to make sure that you don't lose that because once you put it back together, if that little band is not inside where it was, then it's not going to pump properly so I kind of showed you there how to put it back just that that little band is really small so you have to just make sure that it's always there once you take it apart okay so practically I was trying to show how I was taking apart the Mastrena but we were a little bit busy so I wasn't able to just get a perfect uh, picture of it but basically you pull apart you pull uh, the middle part of the Q 
cubes and then you hold it to release the beans in those cubes and then you just take it apart it's really simple of course one of your shifts is going to show you how to do this because that's how you're going to clean it all right i just came on my break um i just found out that the last hour i'm gonna stay alone with one of my shifts so i realized that i cut off the <laughs> the last part of that video but i was basically saying that i was going to be left alone with my shift the last hour so i had to get everything mostly done because if we were going to stay alone and we were, were to get busy i wasn't going to have a lot of time to uh, clean everything and just stock everything so I had to do the most that I could uh, to just have everything done by the end of the night and yeah that's all I I didn't even know why I didn't post it I don't know why I deleted it but yeah <laughs> Here I was starting to work on whipped creams, so I was pumping the vanilla and then inserting it into the container. Whipped creams take a while to make because sometimes you have to do a lot and then you have to date them and then you have to shake them and then you have to, it's like a full process so it's pretty tedious. I show a little bit of how of everything of how I was putting the lid and then how I uh, put the gas and then I had to shake them and then let them sit for two minutes and then once they were ready you have to shake them again one last time So those are the whips. Bruh, all I do is wash dishes. Here I am washing the teas. And sometimes uh, the bottom part of the teas gets stuck, so it's kind of hard. Those are the lids. And then once you wash everything, you just let it air dry and then just put it back where it belongs. Ready for the next day. Next, I was going to start on lemonades. So one of those boxes makes two pitchers. 
and then you just dilute it with water. If you haven't tried the lemonade there, you're missing out because it's so good. If you add stevia, it's so good because it's kind of sour. Then here I dropped the vacuum because I was trying to vacuum the mestrenas because some beans are left inside so you have to vacuum the inside in order for you to return uh, the clean parts and thank god I did not break it okay so here that's what I, I meant earlier um, you pull the middle part to replace those little cubes and then you just push it down to lock them in and then you just put the lids. Next, you turn the little uh, socket to place the pills inside the mesterna so it can clean. And then just start the process. Alright, so I cleaned this part first, and then I cleaned this part first. My store has two cold bars, and then I clean, closed down that mesterna earlier, and I cleaned that one over there. Now they're rinsing, they're just like cleaning themselves. But I think that's about it. I think I'm just gonna restock the lids some vanilla bean on that yeah. so I brought these things to the front I don't know where I should put the phone I forgot to close out the video but I <laughs> I just got home and I'm just gonna go eat really quick <laughs> forgot to close out the video at the store because we just wanted to leave and we finished cleaning right away and I had thrown out this trash but if you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't subscribed yet. <laughs> Bye!